Hi, I'm HSD Interim Superintendent Granita Lathan. Please stand as ROTC cadets from several high schools across the district in HISD lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance and the Texas Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Under the Texas flag, I pledge allegiance to the Texas one state under God. One and indivisible. Thank you, cadets. We appreciate you being with us virtually today. Congratulations, summer 2020 graduates. Today is the culmination of your academic career in HISD. Now you get to celebrate your hard work and dedication. I know the road has not always been easy, but you made it. And I couldn't be prouder of your achievements leading up to this moment. As you celebrate your accomplishments, I want you to take some time to reflect on your journey and remember the lessons it taught you. The past few months were unexpected to say the least. The COVID-19 pandemic presented unforeseen challenges. It pushed you as a student and for many it has been marked with constant change and overwhelming uncertainty. But we'll, what will never change is HISD's commitment to providing you with an education that will offer a firm foundation for your future. You have done your part by completing the requirements for your high school diploma. You did not let these extraordinary circumstances stop you from achieving your goals. You set your sights on what you wanted and you did the necessary work to get it done. Along with your academic studies, you have learned the importance of adapting to new situations. By any measure, transitioning to online learning was no easy task, but each of you worked hard to ensure you graduate today. When so many obstacles threatened to stand in your way, you persevered. You have learned this year that hard times will come, but how you respond to them makes all the difference. The road in life is not always easy and there will be obstacles, but when you find yourself in such a situation, I want you to remember this time. Remember that you triumphed in the toughest of circumstances. Sometimes it took a bit more effort, a bit more grit. Sometimes it took giving all you could and then a little bit more. Sometimes it took tackling challenges and figuring it out along the way. But no matter the challenge, you conquered it and proved to yourself that you can do anything. You let nothing, not even a pandemic, keep you from meeting this challenge head on to achieve one of your biggest milestones. As you prepare to move forward with the next chapter of your life, I know you will do great, exciting things. Always remember your HISD family is standing behind you, cheering you on. On behalf of the entire Houston Independent School District and the HISD Board of Education, congratulations graduates. I know you will continue to make all of us proud. Now please welcome our talented students from the Kinder High School for the Performing and Visual Arts as they perform America the Beautiful.
Ms. Sue Dygaard, President of the HISD Board of Education. On behalf of all nine members of the board, congratulations on your historic achievement today. No other graduating class has had to endure the hardships and overcome the obstacles that all of you have faced in your final year of high school. We are so pleased to honor you today, and you should be so proud of yourselves for achieving this milestone in your education. We all wish we could see each of you proudly walk across that ceremonial stage to receive your diploma. I know you wish the same. Seeing you graduate is the best part of being a trustee. You represent the achievement of our greatest goal to ensure that every child progresses through HISD with the tools they need to graduate and embark on the next journey, pursue the next dream, and achieve new goals. We've heard the word unprecedented a lot lately. I know both as a school board member and as a mom of a recent HISD graduate and also a current high school student, that you confront new challenges and uncertainty as you look to your future after high school. It can be scary. You may not know if you will be able to get the job you planned or if you will still attend college this fall or if you or a loved one will get sick. But don't be afraid because of one thing I am certain for you all, you have everything you need for whatever comes next. You have already shown the ability to persist and succeed, and now your community and your world need you to continue to persist despite the challenges. No matter what path you choose next, believe me when I say that you are the future leaders and problem solvers. You will take the knowledge and skills you have learned these past years and carry them forward to the future and build on them. Although it may not feel like it sometimes, you hold the power to bridge divides between communities and to find creative solutions to the challenges that confront your community and your world. One of the first things you can do to change the world this year is vote. If you are not already registered, please visit votetexas.gov, then cast your vote this November. Your voice, now more than ever, is important to protect our democracy so we can continue together to strive towards a more perfect union where all people, regardless of color or creed, are treated equally under the law and have full opportunity to access the American dream of life, liberty, and pursuit of happiness. The future really is in your hands. Congratulations again to you all. Greetings, my name is Reginald Bush. I am the proud principal of Cashmere Senior High School Mighty Rams. 2020, today, we want to say congratulations and thank you for a job well done. It seems like it was just yesterday when you began pre-K and kindergarten. Today, you have come to the end of a great journey, only to get ready for your next walk of life. We know that you're prepared now for college, career, and the military. 2020, we know that you will go out in every walk of life and do amazing things. Nelson Mandela once said, everything seems impossible until it's done. 2020, it's done. Now it's left up to you to go out and live like a champion. For we know that you went through some sufferings over the last couple of months. However, you still conquered all. 2020, we know for sure that you are prepared. We wanna say thanks to all of our parents, to all of our communities, in the greater Fifth Ward area, the Cashmere Trinity Garden area, North Forest areas, and to the whole North side and the Northeast side of the Houston Independent School District. 2020, we love you, we thank you, we're gonna be praying for you, and we are going to make sure that we see you in the future. 2020, once again, it's done. Congratulations, class of 2020. You've made it to your moment, high school graduation. You know, a lot of people say that graduation is not the end of one's journey, but the beginning of a new one. I challenge you to take on that task, begin life anew, try and just see what happens. And as you're going along your journey, remember all this school year, we face challenges together. And within those challenges, you have built resiliency that will carry you, carry you through any of the obstacles that life throws at you. And along your way, as you encounter home life obstacles or life obstacles in general, use them as reasons you accomplish your goals rather than as excuses for why you don't. 
We are so very proud of you in HISD. You have made it to this moment. It is yours. Own it. Congratulations. We are all so very proud of you. And today we celebrate you. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations, graduates of 2020. What a magnificent accomplishment. You have outdone yourselves. You should be proud of yourselves for all of the time and effort that you have put in in order to receive your high school diploma. Remember, this is only the beginning. There are so many great things waiting for you. Whether you join the workforce or go to college, you will go with pride. Make a difference in the world in which we live. I know this is not the graduation that you dreamed of, but don't let that get you down. You would be the change makers for the rest of us. When you are able, have a celebration with your family and friends and celebrate yourselves the way that we celebrate you today. Thank your parents for all of their support and your teachers that supported you along the way. Always hold your head up high and do what you know is right. It will pay off. Stay the course. Once again, congratulations, class of 2020. My name is Michael Nigley, and I'm the principal of Waltrip High School. I recently heard someone say that life is like a fistful of Sour Patch Kids. Right now, things are sour, but eventually they will turn sweet. Things may seem that way for many of us during this unprecedented time in our country's history. Nothing has been normal for the past five months as you have steadily worked towards your graduation moment. Coronavirus has closed school buildings and altered the lives of millions of people across the nation. But you persevered through these challenges, and now you have arrived at an important milestone in your life. I hope that you have a great feeling of pride within you as you now graduate from high school. As Michelle Obama once said, you should never view your challenges as a disadvantage. Instead, it is important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is actually one of your biggest advantages. Losing the last third of your senior year to a virus was not what you had planned, but it's definitely an experience that will affect your lives forever and a memory that you will never ever forget. All of us are made up of our experiences and our memories. All of the things that you have been through up to this point make you who you are. And the best part is you're not done yet. You'll continue to experience things and make memories every day that mold you into who you truly are and who you are meant to become. And by persevering through the current pandemic and graduating while supporting your family and the loved ones around you, you are now an inspiration to many who seek to reach their potential in life. Just imagine if everyone, every individual, lived up to his or her own potential. Think about how amazing that would be and how much better off the world would be. And now imagine if just half of those individuals lived up to their potential. The world would still be an awesome place. Even if a quarter of those individuals worked to make their lives successful, they could still make some amazing contributions to society. While you may not have the power to inspire the entire world to strive for success, you do have the power to achieve great heights for yourself and inspire those around you. My challenge to each of you and to myself is to do all that you can do to reach your full potential. If every student in this graduating class is able to do that, just imagine the effect that you would have in your neighborhood, your communities, and in our wonderful city. The future is truly in your hands. Now go out there and make the most of it. Congratulations, graduates. To the class of 2020, congratulations. The culmination of years of education is not an easy feat to accomplish, but you all were successful in your goal. I would like to recognize your parents, family members, teachers, and staff, as they too helped guide you to ensure that you accomplished your goals. Each individual played an intricate and supportive role in your journey, but this is just one of many special moments. 
Continue to allow those who love and care for you to help you as you transition out of high school. Former First Lady Michelle Obama said, you should never view your challenges as a disadvantage. Instead, it's important for you to understand that your experience facing overcoming adversity is actually one of your biggest advantages. The challenges highlighted your ability to strive towards your goals. They're a part of your story, your life experience, and how you're still able to succeed. Do not lose your momentum. Don't allow others to deter you from your success. Surround yourself with positivity. As you continue on your journey, I want you to reflect on the times that pushed you to your limits, mentally, socially, physically, and emotionally, and how you persevered through all the challenges that you encountered thus far. Do not allow the moments that you stumble to occupy your thoughts, but focus on the ability to rise and move forward. You will continue to encounter barriers, but view those roadblocks as continuous lessons. Stay the course towards your dreams. Do not be afraid to challenge the status quo for the betterment of society. Be the voice for new innovations and for those that might be afraid. Life is wrought with choices. Choose to add value to society. I want to leave you with one last parting thought. Although you've achieved this great milestone today, there are many more milestones that you will continue to achieve. Do not allow adversity to hinder your ability to achieve your goals. Don't stay stagnant. Continue to seek out opportunities, growth, and learning as you continue on with your journey. Always remember to be a part of the solution. Be proactive. Be an advocate for positive change in society and never stop learning. The persistence, determination, and resilience that she put forth during these challenging times is to be commended and always will be remembered. Congratulations again to the class of 2020. Congratulations. We are so proud of you. On behalf of the faculty and staff of Middle College High School Gulfton Campus, we would like to welcome all parents, grandparents, sisters, brothers, aunts, uncles, nieces, nephews, cousins, and friends to the summer 2020 virtual graduation. Students, you have demonstrated how resilient you are and will be in the future by having to endure a season of transition. As you transcend into college, military, or workforce life, remember to keep the determination and hard work ethic which you have already used towards accomplishing your high school diploma. People say this about school. As long as you work hard, you can be whoever you would like to be. You can do whatever you want to do, and you can go wherever you want to go. This is partially true. In addition to hard work, you must consistently perform. You have to demonstrate competency and mastery at all times, even under less than ideal circumstances. I cannot tell you that there will not be obstacles in your lives that you will encounter. Many of you have already experienced some obstacles prior to graduation and you made it through. As you move to the next chapter in your lives, I would like for you to focus on three goals. The first goal is planning. Pace yourselves by thinking and writing about what you should do first, second, and so on. Secondly, prepare yourself with as much education as needed. Start with HCC by reviewing courses offered this fall semester. Thirdly, communication. You must be able to communicate both verbally and in written form. Lastly, I will say to each of you, start each day believing in your future and know without a doubt you were made for great things. Thank you and congratulations again. Good morning. I am Michael McDonough, Principal of Bel Air High School. And on behalf of all the HISD high school principals, I've been asked to share a few words regarding the significance of this event. Today you are graduating and this will forever remain a fond memory for you as you head off into your next great adventure. Each August, the HISD comes together as one to celebrate our summer graduates. The nickname that has often been attributed to this event is that it is the Rainbow Graduation or the Skittles Commencement. The idea is that seeing each of the colors from our schools represented is as majestic as a rainbow or as sweet as a pack of candy. And while it is understandable for each of you to quickly identify with your particular school, this event is also a reminder that we are all part of something larger, 
a network of educators focused on ensuring that you are ready to take on the challenges we face as we ebb our way further into the 21st century. Now in the past, this celebration has been filled with handshakes, posed pictures, and the moving of tassels. And while this year the setting is certainly different and the precautions new, this event, this very moment, remains significant. So I encourage you to resist the urge to treat this differently than any other year. Snap those pictures, move those tassels from the right to the left, toss your cap high into the air and soak up the energy and excitement that accompanies this achievement. And then get ready, because we need you. We need your insight, your commitment, and your passion. Frankly, we are counting on you to lean into uncertainty, to not shy away from difficulty, and to lead us forward. Ladies and gentlemen, I now introduce to you the HISD Summer Graduating Class of 2020. Jasmine Alfaro. Joanna Angeles. Darwin Alexander Chan. Arliss Cortez. Marcus Diggs Jr. Catalina Celia Dominguez Gonzalez. Ignacio Heriberto Galvan Jr. Kevin Jesus Gutierrez. Marlon Leonardo Lee. Christina Abigail Macias Jaramillo. Maria Guadalupe Martinez. Bianca Adamari Medrano. Madison Sujay Medens Bueno. Leslie Negrete. Itzel Guadalupe Quezada Aguirre. Jose Alberto Ramos. Mauricio Sauceda Mendo. Jose Alfredo Solis Olvera. Erwin Rafael Trigos. Jose Maria Tumax. Martin Valdez Jr. Vicente Yanez. Juan Angel Zavala. Rudolph Castillo. Jordan Chappelle. Montserrat Cruz. Alex Ebarb. Karina Estrada. Maria Figueroa Banegas. Zakti Fuentes. Angel Galindo. Jennifer Garcia Coto. Zedarian Griffith. Brianna Hoyos. David Jiang. Emmanuel Perez. Felix Reyes Gonzalez. Robert Singh. Mauro Eugenio Benavides. Victoria Yasmin Betancourt. 
Kevin Castillo. Sebastian Cervantes. Michael Jacob Chavira. Joshua Dayon Collins. Carlos Antonio Davila. Jesus Alejandro de Leon Esquivel. Felipe de Jesus Diaz Rodriguez. Hung Quang Din. Marvin Edgardo Galindo. Claudia Teresa Gallardo. Veronese Garcia. Juan Alberto Garza Jr. Adrian Lamone Gale. Angela Gonzalez. Raul Gonzalez. Maria Guadalupe Balbasto Zarate. Ivan Hernandez. Daniela Hernandez Morales. Alexander Henry Jimenez III. Eamon Rashawn Lewis. Ever Limon. Camilla Lozano. Cesar Antonio Marquez Diaz. Yareli Martinez. Amy Dolores Miller. Joanna Belin Morales. Mark Nathaniel Morera. Jesus A. Nino Hernandez. Jose de Jesus Ortiz. Alan Alberto Paz. Rachel Yvette Puente. Juan Francisco Quintero. Fabio Alejandro Rivas. Laura Giselle Rivera. Alexis Rodriguez. Christina Nicole Rodriguez. Andrew Damone Rogers. Estrella Sanchez. Gabriel Isaiah Santillan. Benjamin Alberto Cigaran. Daniela Tapia Serrato. Esau Adonai Torcios. Hi, I'm Esau Torcios. I'm graduating with class of 2020. Thanks to everybody that believed in me. And yeah. Crystal Gabriela Valenzuela Aguilera. Angel Allen Valverde. Marco Antonio Vasquez Jr. Alejandro Vega Perez. Diego Emilio Yanez. Anthony Zarco. Benjamin Acosta Gomez. 
Nicholas Hitai. Daniel Ojeda. Daniel Rodriguez. Anthony Rutherford. Angel Delgado. Mario David Martinez Gavarete. Dylan Brown. Ruby Canellas. Eliezer Hernandez Castaneda. Raul Hernandez Tristan Jr. Juan Laredo. Ranferi Nunez. Stephanie Orellana Fuentes. Israel Gallardo Guerrero. Star Maya Mendoza. Michael Randale Brimsey Jr. Brooke Marie Bruno. Denilson Cardona Dubon. Michaela Alia Coleman. Junior Echeverria Fernandez. Edouard Alexander Hiron Casasola. Celso Lisandro Banda. Rodrigo Yamas. Brandon Lopez. Ricardo Alder Lopez Rendon. Luis Manzanares. Josue Peña Serna. Bajane LaShawn Porter. Andrea Charisse Prevost. Davion Young. Xavier Allen Evans. Noah Trayvon Henry. Angel Ray Morin. Cheyenne Marie Morris. Jose Angel Murillo. Christian Adolfo Perez Vasquez. Noah Abdullah Smith Ali. Brianna Simone Citizen. Roberto Carlos Guevara. Xavier Troy Hall Frazier. Chart de Leon Harris Jr. Morris de Jesus Marroquin Herrera. Stephen Wynn. Nayeli Orellana. Jessica Perez. Harin Amanda Ramirez. Zarius Robert Vital. Abraham Hernandez. Paris Hill. Adriano Ruiz. 
Camilo Sanchez. Elizabeth Cervantes. Diana Lilia Cruz. Yahir de Jesus Espinosa Aguilar. Raul Quasle Gonzalez. Brian Alejandro Perez Avalos. Ruth Esmeralda Segovia. Isabel Lynn Torres. Tania Lizette Serna Garcia. Lucas Aguirre. Jose Cristino Bonilla. Ivan Flores. Mario Garcia Gil. Jesus Hernandez. Oscar Jimenez. Miguel Medina. Liliana Mercado. Jesse Munguia. Crystal Nunn. Ravon Nunn. Yathziri Perez. Ashley Nicole Reyes. Gersel Andrea Romo Alba. Jerry Torres. Cosme Mark Vincent. Jamel Deante Banks. Carla Liliana Parada Rivas. Miriam Rodriguez Zuniga. Adriana J. Salado. Alia Lopez Guerrero. Alfonso Garcia. Dominicia Jackson. Astil Castaneda. Rosemary Flores. Armani Funderburk. A Legacy Howard. Brady Johnson. Eduardo Sanchez Cibrian. Armando Tonche. Tahani Algezi. Eduardo Arias. Andrew Brosque. Edgar Gonzalez. Ali Hassan. Daniel Hernandez. Victoria Jacobs. Ashlyn Parker. Nelly Posada Tampa. Malika Rapulu. Charles Robertson. 
Corina Rocha. Catherine Street. Nyla Virani. Jennifer De La Cruz. Chrisharia James. And I also want to give a big, 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 big shout out to my support system. Thank you guys so much for making this happen. I appreciate it. Jose Ramirez Rivas. Trevion Turner. Rosie Vega. Miracle Grant. Zelt Miner. David Jose Torres. Ramsey's Lionel Acosta. Megan Viart Jimenez. Yadida Aileen Martinez Polito. Aileen Lisa Milanda. John Anthony Morales. Martin Segura. Sasha Flower. Alan McDonald. Citravius Randall Oscar Rivas Edie E. Augustine Yancey E. Aravalo Maldonado Felipe Baca Reyes Ali M. Bader. Pedro L. Belloza Lagos. Josue Cardoso Barrios. Dania L. Serna Morales. Joseph J. Cogswell. Diego A. Granados Sorto. Rafael N. Gutierrez Shavalok. Alan C. Lopez. Ellison Mejia Melendez. Marcel N. Mujere. Hasnain Panwar. Noel Rodriguez. Felix D. Salcedo. Luis A. Sosa Arellano. Marlon M. Tejada Rivas. Lucas F. Tumac Zapeta. Armando N. Vasquez. Bryant A. Ibarra. Troy Lee McGee. William Jesus Watson. Luis Benavides. Gerald Dokes. Greetings. My name is Dr. Luis Landa, proud principal of Chavez High School. 
I would like to first start off by giving all of our Houston ISD graduates a big round of applause. Congratulations to you and your parents, teachers, mentors, and friends that have stood by you in reaching this accomplishment. Today is truly your day, and today marks the end of an academic chapter. As you move on to colleges, universities, the military and workforce, I would like to encourage each of you to continue giving your best and aiming for excellence in all future endeavors. Likewise, always advance in pursuit of your dreams and aspire to pay it forward by aiming to make a difference in the lives of others. Keep in mind that together we can overcome any obstacle that comes our way and together we can ensure that all those around us will also fulfill their destiny. Remember that you will always be a part of the Houston Independent School District and that our entire community will always be here for you. You have made us extremely proud and we celebrate you. Congratulations on this monumental achievement. Saludos. Mi nombre es Dr. Luis Landa, orgulloso director de la Escuela Secundaria Chávez. Primero me gustaría comenzar dando un gran aplauso a todos nuestros graduados de Houston ISD. Felicitaciones a usted y sus padres, maestros, mentores y amigos que lo han apoyado para alcanzar este logro. Este es su día y hoy termina un capítulo académico para usted. Ahora que nuestros graduados se van a colegio, universidades, el ejército y la fuerza laboral, me gustaría animar a cada uno a continuar dando lo mejor de sí mismo en todos los esfuerzos futuros. Siempre avancen en su búsqueda de sus sueños y aspiren a hacer la diferencia en la vida de otros. Juntos podemos superar cualquier obstáculo que nos presente y juntos podemos asegurarnos que todos cumplan su destino. Recuerde que siempre será parte del Distrito Escolar Independiente de Houston y que todos nuestra comunidad siempre estará aquí para apoyarlo. Nos han hecho muy orgulloso y lo celebramos. Felicidades por este gran logro. Congratulations, class of 2020. You did it against all odds, but this is just the beginning. Remember, you can do anything with hard work and determination. Continue to reach for the stars. Graduates, please stand. By the power vested in me, by the state of Texas, and the Board of Education of the Houston Independent School District, and upon the recommendation of the principals and faculties, I confer you the high school diploma with all rights and privileges thereunto appertaining on this 22nd day of August, 2020. You may now turn your tassels from your right to your left. Congratulations again.